for you. I want you to be in heaven. If you can hear my voice, I love you enough to tell you I want you in heaven. I want you in heaven, folks. I don't want you in hell. I want your parents in heaven. I want your husband and your wife in heaven. I want your children in, he in heaven. Teach your children about Jesus. Teach these children about Jesus. These children who are following the wrong ways, being misguided by the society and the community. There is only one way to get right with God and that's through the Son of God. That's Jesus. We are living in perilous times, folks, where people will call good evil and evil good. Repent. Repent for the kingdom of God is at hand. You could meet him tonight. Is he going to be right with you? If you are to meet God tonight, will you be right with God or will you be wrong with God? John 3, 16, give us hope. John 3, 17, tell us for God did not send his son into this world to condemn the world, but through him that the world might be saved. Through the name of the Son of God, the world might be saved. Buddha won't save you. Krishna won't save you. Mohammed won't. None of this worldly religion will save you. But Jesus will. And that's why he died on that cross for our sins. He was buried. He rose again from the dead. And he says, anybody who comes to me, I will give them eternal life. Anybody who calls upon my name, I will save them. And we want you to be saved, folks. We don't want you to end up in hell. Heaven and hell is real. So I pray that the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit remain unto this place convicting mankind of their sins.